Welcome back, everybody, to the adventures of Queen Ireland, the flower of the Cypriot League, the mighty warriors of Greece who are eventually destined to go and form Atlantis. We've got Ireland, the flower. Don't forget she's 58. We've still got, like, another three years or so before we can flip another law. After that, because of our vassal management a couple of episodes ago, and that's what I'm going to call it, definitely not war crimes, we, after that, will have Ireland the second, who is insanely good beside the fact that she's got uh, syphilis. Don't worry about that. Syphilis has never hurt anybody, ever. So... We are still working on our goal to centralize the Cypriot League into the Kingdom of Cyprus to assure that we have total and dominant control over these islands before we go and pick up other islands. But like I said, because of our vassal management a couple of episodes ago, we have full power anyway. We decide who gets elected. We choose who we're going to play as next. It's basically, I mean, Republic succession, right? It's not even Tanistry because Tanistry still has electors. We've cut that down to the extent it's just us. So unless our last two vassals gang up, which they're definitely never going to do because vassals never will because they're idiots, unless one buys favor from the other, I guess, um, we are always going to get our candidates who succeed us, which is arguably even more powerful than your Republic succession. So we're in a really, really good place right now. All we need to do past those last couple of laws, I mean, our future is assured with her. I don't really know what's left to do with our current character, Island the Flower, besides just kill time. It, it genuinely is. We don't want to kill... No, 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 no. Speaking of killing, don't kill my daughter. That would suck. Um, so we've got our Mysticos scheming. I think we'll try and dig up a better Mysticos then. All we've got to do is ensure that the succession goes smoothly with our current character. Ensure that our realm takes no damage. Ensure that everything's going as fine as it possibly can be. Accrue some gold. You know, try and, try and rule with a gentle but firm fist until succession is time. Um... Swap me out for you, because you'll have a slightly higher opinion if I do this. There we are. Um, was the other guy greedy? I could have I could have sworn he was greedy. It doesn't matter too much. Anyway, I'm going to get this guy to scheme. That's the reason I was getting a slightly better Mysticos, so that we can have us uncover plots a little bit easier. And maybe try and foil who's ever trying to kill our our successor. What was I killing her? Oh, because she stole my shit. I remember. Stole a dragon amulet. You shit. Um, we could just go raid it. That's what we can do while we're waiting for these laws to change. We can go out raiding. We could bring in a shitload of wealth into the round. Let's let our troops reinforce to start off with, because it's not... We haven't got exactly the strongest armor right now. 25% um, chance of getting it humble. Ah! Uh, we could go for humble. Proud prestige versus piety. Let's go for prestige. Let's go for prestige. Now, another thing we could be doing, actually, while we wait for our daughter to succeed us, is claiming the holy sites. Do we want to go for the holy sites of Greece? How many troops they got? 7,500. To be honest, they're not much stronger than us when we are fully reinforced. They are almost fully reinforced. They've got a maximum of like 8,500. We've got a maximum of just shy of 6,000. But we're obviously a much better commander, and we have much better commanders. The AI is not so good, especially at dealing with island nations. With us and our successor, with, with, with Ireland and Ireland leading our armies, I think we could smash them even though there's a 3,000 troop count difference, right? Let's give it a go. They want us to bring another one of our children into the fold. That's absolutely fine. I mean, what's she like? Australia is utter shit. I'm so sorry, Australia. Maybe she'll also take a shield maiden. Yeah, she did. Okay, cool. Let's try and make her into something a little bit more useful. Oh. Never mind then. <laughs> okay. Um, should we remember for a tireless attempts to renovate and expand Limassol? Yes. Yes, she will. Having mastered many skills, she is sure to be admired by many subjects. Long live Queen Ireland II. Should point out, uh, I have a bit of a fever as I'm recording this. I don't think it's that disease, but if it is, you'll have to excuse the misplays. I feel like that disease is the biggest one to, uh, is 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 a big excuse. That's a, f a fully valid excuse. Right, so, um, what the hell are we going to do with you then? We can get a war focus, crank her right up to like 26. We need to speed back through the society now. Because the legend bar is 29% filled. We are only at warrior rank. We need 1,000 renown. We're halfway to rank 3. We need to blitz our way through. And I think it's going to be very, very difficult. Because, of course, as we complete quests, it's going to crank that legend bar up. So we've got to work very, very, very quickly and tirelessly if we want to do that. I am going to take war focus in that case to give us the extra personal combat, whatever else. Wow, this is going to be close. Um, Grimanair surely couldn't hurt, seeing as we don't have one right now. Um, we want to set crown focus. So, obviously, let's go back to our... New, let's go for our new capsule this time rather than wherever we were before. Where was that really what I was overseeing Crown Focus with previously? What a fool. Um, right, okay. Marshall, welcome. Spymaster, welcome. They actually like us quite a lot. The counselor, kind of on our side for the most part. No negative opinion there, which is really all that matters. Seek Trip Fairness. Let's see if we can deal with that. Let's also write a book on war. That would help out massively. We are brave. He's got 17. I could trust him here. 
Oh, he's got syphilis as well, huh? I see what's happened. It's the only way we can possibly lose syphilis is by going for the risky treatment. Bollocks. That could be a problem. Oh, you fool. How long have we got until we're dead? We've got to survive... Oh, we've got to survive another 10 months with this. You absolute prick. One health. Oh, no. Fuck. Um, okay, 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 okay. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Um, congratulations, Sporklands. You've been elected. He's not bad either. He's certainly not as good as our current character. We've just got to sit here and pray that we live. Renowned? She's renowned. Okay. Welcome. Kiriaki. Please. Seek treatment. When can we do it? Has it not been treated recently? So we have to wait for that to expire, do we? Thank fucking God for that. I've learned something new as well. Apparently, you don't have to wait for this to disappear. You can do it before it's expired. So we didn't quite survive the two years or whatever it's been just waiting for that to disappear. We didn't have to stack it up or anything like that. It was after, like, half of its course had run. You can then search for another treatment, which is when this new woman, the renowned physician, gave us a successful one. So she didn't have to survive the full course of that botched treatment, luckily. So we're safe for the time being. I'm still going to try and cure it permanently, though, because having great pox is a massive pain in the ass, like I said. I, I want to get rid of the particularly the fertility hit. It's a real ball ache. Um, this is still our top priority. Getting through this is definitely 100% our top priority. Really? Oh, I mean, it was. Oh, he's also aberrant. Um, yikes. Never mind. I mean, it's, it's a temporary thing. We still gain the honor, so that doesn't matter. we just got to try and level up as fast as possible now. Um, is there anything else we could do for the society? We, can, like, summon a, we don't want to do that. There's nothing else you can just casually do, not like donate or train people or anything. It is just through quests. I don't think we're going to get back to the highest level. I think we're going to miss out on a fucking le- Oh, come on. I hate you all. <laughs> I hate you all. You all suck. Um, whatever. Legend of the Kindness increases. Yeah, we're going to miss out on this. Pregnant, though. Good. All she needed was a little bit of a lunacy. Um, what have you got for me here? General opinion plus 10. Yeah, give me that. The Truth Speaker, that's kind of cool. And Gluttonous 2, <laughs> great. Everything's going a bit wrong. Um, the baby is surely my husband's bastard, though my darling denies it is but a man. Um, slut Seductress, I've never seen that before. My rival? It's my brother's wife? Slay her. The Slut Seductress, I've never seen that modifier before. Kill her dead. Destroy. I will spend the entire treasury of our goddamn round to kill her. Look, even her own husband wants her dead. I think we're good. Um, let's get you. That's almost certainly the person that's trying to kill us off as well. I'm not doing that out of pure spite. It is probably going to help keep us alive as well. So, oh, what the? F She's already gone? Ugh. Okay, let's hire another court physician then. What a shit. Um, yeah, we've done it too recently. All right, never mind then. Um, Aurich, help me, friend. Back to you again. Oh, good. Here we are. Another horrible mistreatment. We're stressed. That's fine. Um, when can we do it again? Oh, we, no, so we have to wait for successful treatment to fade away. Right, fine. Memnon, who is fair. Oh, God, appealing. And Gemini. Oh, God, you're really bad. You're really bad. Okay, let's go for the island of M man. How do you misspell man, though? <laughs> Experiment with real island man is spelled like that. How do you misspell man? M M man. Man. Excellent. I will admit that was very inspired. 10 out of 10 name there. Um, we'll try and train you, but I feel like struggle is an incredibly appropriate title for you here, my friend. I couldn't think of a more appropriate focus because you are fucked. Melissa. She is our close friend. I, I remember her. Oh, God. Here we go. I can't believe we got fucking lunacy from... That's got to be from syphilis, right? Why? Just fucking let her die. Honestly, just chuck yourself into the Aegean Sea because you do not stand a fucking chance here, chief. Oh, God. I don't know. Getting the contract. Well, that's fine. That's something. Getting the diary. She's, she's just a constant fucking sack of death. You are just a big sack of dirty death. Oh, great. So we got the flu. We got stressed. We got wounded. We got great pox. She's got 4.5 health still. Try something new. Strike him down. Are you fucking kidding me? Well, at least we lost wounded. 3.5 health. To be fair, to say that we've got all of that. We've still got 3.5 health. That's fine. Murder on the orders. People knew it was going to happen. They'll turn the other way. Well, I'm going to go dig up her head. Don't do that. That's, that's a surefire way to catch the virus I've got. Uh, severely injured flu. Oh, fuck me. I thought you were the chosen one, and all you've ended up choosing is an early grave. Well, she lost the flu. We've lost severely injured. We lost wounded. Still got to deal with stressed and great pox. Go. 
cure me. Nice. I mean, we've traded an eye for that, so that's not going to help out too much with the society. How are we looking? We actually might be able to do this. It's going to be bloody goddamn close, though. Marshall Scard gives us plus one. Oh, thank God. Okay, that's fine then. Fucking problem solved, huh? So we can rank up very, very soon. We've got to be careful not to intentionally do things to raise the legend bar. If we've got a choice to not do it, let's not fucking do it. Jewel for blood. We can't do that because we're ill. Oh, we're involved in a war. Um, oh, that doesn't count as being unwell, really? Oh, you must just have bedridden or severe illness. I was going to say, like, she's a stressed syphilitic lunatic, and apparently that doesn't count. Fine. All right, there we are. Our, our, the guy we're supposed to do died, so that's kind of unfortunate. But here we go. Cessation of Violence Act. Plus side, it means we haven't filled the legend bar. We're looking at 53%. And how much have we got at 1,500? 2,000. Fuck. Um, three years. We've got three years to hope that this legend bar doesn't fill up so we can make a bloodline. I mean, hey, there's a, there's a chance. I'm not going to lie, there is a chance. But it's very tricky. Uh, legend of the Companion increases. I don't give a fuck about the Companion's Legend. Okay, let's try it again then. So, sack you. And then, recruit court physician. Hopefully, we get another renowned physician. The chance of actually it being good at all is... Oh, okay. Renowned physician. Yeah, shrewd. Okay, I can see it. Load up the cars with, car with cheese and wine. Welcome. And then, we'll get him to try and tend us to us again. Successful treatment. When's that fade away? Uh, 26, 26... Two fucking years? Really? Okay, I guess we got to put up with that for a bit longer. Might as well get out there and start raiding. Because our, our troops are fully reinforced. Or, alternatively, can we grab the holy sites? Um, it's not like... Wait, it is Reformation. Oh, shit. Okay, my bad. I thought it was... Um, I thought rather than Reformation, it was just like creating a religious head title similar to Cesar Rastrian. But no, it is full-blown Reformation then. Oh, right, of course. They've added all the custom things. Right, so Athens. 10,000 men. Looks like they've been bashed around by Yugoslavia a little bit. Um, Cephalonia. Or Zaknithos, neither of which are the holy sites we're after. Rome. Okay, so we don't have, like county conquest similar to like Norse or something. Um, we would have to start fabricating claims. Okay, you're safer. You're you're the safer target. And then we got Alexandria, who is under Israel, who are absolutely gigantic. Holy sites are a little bit off the table. I will admit, we'd have to unify Greece. Um, press. Sure, let's just start fabricating claims then. Why not? And then we can obviously go out. We, we can go out to... Oh, that's our husband, isn't it? Oh, I don't mind. Um, we can go out and do some raiding at the same time. There's no reason we can't do that while we wait for our claims to fabricate, of course. Let's go visit my man, the Pope, and see if he's got some bones he'd like to donate. Doot, doot. Thank you, Mr... It's got to be a pun there. Hang on. Thank you, Mr. Ecumenical. That's the best I've got. That's fucking terrible. Okay. Um, right, excuse me. Join me here. Surely with child. Excellent. Maybe she just ate a lot of food. I've always found that event very weirdly phrased. I'm surely with child, as opposed to what exactly? Right, let's go and get <laughs> confront Chrysippopos and reveal his dishonest ways to the world. As long as it doesn't fill the legend bar, I'll do whatever it takes here. Jewel for honor, do it right now. What do you mean? Trifon? Jewel is not pregnant? I have a feeling it's probably us. That's very annoying. Difficult pregnancy. Oh my god, she's gonna die again! You are an unbelievable fool. How is this this difficult? What do you mean the Middle Ages were a tough time? Um, right, so... Arsenios, court tutor, Eupraxia. These, these commanders are very good. I'm actually quite impressed. I'd like to be leading the armies. We also did the warrior training to gain the... Uh, the whatever that trait says. I can't see it. My cursor's covering it over. Um, we get the movement speed and everything else too. Oh my god, that's a lot of movement speed we got, brother. That's 30% bonus to movement speed. Thank you. Right, let's go and visit the Pope. Grab some of his shit. I hate that the Papal States is a separate kingdom entirely. It's very confusing. Drunkard or depressed? Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, I thought we'd go for depressed because that one wasn't guaranteed, but that would be if we've got it a minus health. Oh, never mind. She... What is wrong with you? You just want to die, don't you? You're just willing it to happen, you fool. Ireland the third. She's astute as well. We've ha we've got another chance. Okay, pause it. Assign guardian. Educate her immediately. Uh, but this guy's insane. Court tutor Arsenius. I guess that's why he's here, huh? Get him hired. Um. I can't believe it. We've got Ireland the third. There's a chance. There's a, there's a chance we could pull it off. I am burning down Rome just for the gold. Um, we've already made a good load, and we've only taken the attempt to recover from depression. I uh, just feel better. Just fucking cheer up, chief. Right, okay. Jewel for honor. Suffered enough. A 75% chance of losing stressed and depressed. <gasps> oh. Um. Hey, that's what we're after. Very good. She has become a heifer. 
Too much eating and exercise caught up with me. Well, that's one way to deal with stressed and depressed, huh? Right, now we're going to duel this guy and probably get our ass handed to us because she's lost an eye and now she is large. Never mind. Never mind. She can still kill a man, although that's increased. <laughs> Legend bar. It's going to be very close, but look, it's only gone up 17% and we are more than 17% towards the next rank to put it into perspective. So, although it was 17% halfway, so don't, look, don't talk. Don't, look, overall, it's gone up like 34%. Oh, no. Relative to what it was already at. Okay, we, we could be in a little bit of trouble here. Is that 34% of 2,000? Quit doing the numbers. Yes, we're fine. We're safe. Lessons taught to me by my enemy by Queen Island II, number three. Confusing. That just means it's quality three. It doesn't mean it's volume three. Written by Queen Island II, the third. Although, given the naming scheme, we are going about that way. Martial plus one, intrigue plus one, personal combat skill plus six. Good. Hey, I think that's, that's probably the best thing we could hope for right now. Come on, how are we looking? Oh, fuck. It's going up so fast now. Um... Imprison him. 25% chance of gaining just. Fuck. Now all we've done is piss people. Okay, release him again. Um, uh, change air. We can just change air freely, don't forget. So let's flip to Island the Third. After the dungeons with him. Oh, very nice. We've got plenty of people to ransom off too. This is making us a bloody fortune. Holy shit. We're rolling in it. Spores in Abydos. Okay. Um, we will head over there in a second. Let me just tidy up Rome first because nobody's bothered about the fact that we are burning down... The Pope. Obviously, Catholicism not as powerful in this world compared to base CK2. Pelops and Falklands the second. Very nice. I'm not going to name very, very, very distant relatives, especially when we've got... Oh, uh, no. What? What is this? Enemies near... What? Oh, no. Go. What are you fucking kidding me? What is wrong with the... Why are you constantly dying of shit? This is not even stuff that I'm actively... Twice, I've made the active decision to potentially injure her and twice we failed on the roll everything else though the syphilis the lunacy the depression the stress the flu every fucking thing else the troubled pregnancy not my problem nice plus two acts though hey that's that's a consolation prize she's got fucking 18 personal combat you've gotten actively worse we're never gonna get this legend bar oh that's so annoying who are you no fuck off i don't need a gardener thank you send me to abydos a duchy level claim just as we find a boatload of gold lying around in the Vatican, unguarded, undefended for the Pope that he donated to my coffers. Very nice, inconvenient, and good. Okay. Um, well, that's one holy side down with. Uh, oh God, yeah, they've taken a lot. Are you guys sorry? I feel like we're basically painting a massive target on our back for those guys to come and attack us. Right, so that was... Let's take Odessa. We're going to have to go to war with Yugoslavia, which I feel like is a horrible idea, but hey. We'll get claims on everywhere, and we'll at least push them with this character, even if we don't succeed. Well, I completed the mission. Did that count? Loot Abydos. Oh, some pricks already sieged it. Who's that? Right, we're going to go... Just go make ourselves hostile and then come back. We should be able to assault it down. Uh, yeah, there we are. Boom. Nice. More gold for me. Thank you. Uh, a smooth $780 reduce is very good. Thank you very much. Now, what can we build in the capital then? Cataphract certainly couldn't hurt. A keep wouldn't hurt as well. It's a... Uh... Wait. Another 15% levy size. That's a lot. That's a lot of troops. Thank you. Um, let's go for this one as well, seeing as it's our cap capital duchy. Leaves us with 262 gold, just in case we happen to form another... Just in case we form another... Claim. That's the word I was looking for. This is going to be so close. 85%. And we need another 500. Oh, my God. We can murder our way up there. We can murder our way through. Right to court. No. What if I... What if I bring you here? No, by favor. Yes. No, impossible. She's Marshall. Mysticos. Okay. What about you? She's he's in my court already. <gasps> what if you were to die? 88%. Okay, 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 okay. Clear out some ranks, get us elected. Just 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 jump jump to the top of the the food chain. Oh my god, we're cured of dirty syphilis, but we've chopped off yet another fucking body part. Scarred for life. Thank you. I appreciate that. Uh, oh, I learned beta is ready. We got right. This is cool. So this is the culture one of the devs told me about that uh, will give us all of the. I think I talked about it actually in the last episode. But they, they give us a shitload of tech points just for having him around. Um, he's also a great steward. Let's do it. Get him on board. Yeah. Okay. Uh, and let's get you collecting some taxes. Oh, immediately. Look at that. Wow. Fifty tech points straight off the bat. This is painful to watch because I don't think I can do anything about it. Oh fuck. Ninety four percent. Stop. Please stop. Please. Please, brother. Brother, brother, brother. 97%. Brother, 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 brother. <laughs> no. 
We got so close. Motherfucker. I'm so... Ah, oh, it's a hundred years. We gotta wait for all the next fucking bloodline. Um, well, look, 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 look at it this way. There are family members, so we might be able to just breed it back in. I am quite livid about that, though. Comes Theestus has declared the highest ranking members of the Quenus to go on an adventure. Good luck, I suppose, or I still have a lot to learn. Uh, we'll take proud. I'm so fucking annoyed at that. We got so goddamn close. I'm still going to kill them. Just as just as a vengeance thing, really, because they've annoyed me. Right, fine, I won't do it, because I know people will get annoyed at me. Why are you murdering your family members, despite that you've got a very perfectly good legitimate reason for doing so? Okay, um, let's get back out there, then. We've only got eight gold left, so we might as well go back out there and uh, be around some merch republics. I was told there was merch republic nearby us that would provide a good amount of gold. He says, look at the economy, Matt Mode. Um, yes, where? Where's your, where's your... Ah, yes. Okay, there's one there. Good. Okay, let's go and hit that, then. Fuck it. What have we also got? Have we got one up here as well? Actually, to be honest, hitting Constantinople wouldn't hurt, because apparently they are... Church fortifications? A theocracy? Well, that makes the top-level haunting very easy to burn down. Yeah, so all the way up around Crimea, there's a load of merchant republics. We've got this one here, too. Um, oligarchic republics, I imagine, will have some cash to them there. The imperial governments. Is that... Is Britain got imperial? What the hell is that, then? Br D Britannia? Oh! Oh, I see. <laughs> I was like, oh, what's happened there? They seem to have split apart. The other thing I was concerned about as well. Oh, my God. The... So this is obviously what we want to try and conquer to get Atlantis. Um, it's going to say they split into two different kingdoms. Oh, look at that one. Look at the flag. That's 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 going to be us one day. Bear with me. I was going to say, worst case scenario would be if Britain just conquested that. Because I mean, have to go through Britain. It turns out they've actually made them into a tributary. So fingers crossed that's as far as they go. Because fighting a tributary is a lot easier than fighting just the whole of Britain. I'm here for your money. Thank you. Don't Please don't resist. Okay, let's see how much gold we make out of this. And we're leading the center. No, no, you can stay. I, I don't think they'll attack us. And even if they do attack us, we should be good. Come on. Nice, there we are. How much should we get? 108. Actually, I mean, it would be better to go for Rome. Oh, artifacts would be good to go for as well. I mean, I think it would be better to go for Rome when it's rebuilt, just because of how easy that was. And again, normally the downside to attacking Rome is the fact that all the Catholics will gang up and kick your ass. But we don't have to worry about that in this world, because the Catholics are a little bit, um, a little bit undermined. Hello, Mayor Diogenes Gerlam. Okay, we'll help him. By which I mean, apparently we're going to duel him. Fine. He's got an artifact. We got... We should be checking for artifacts. He's got the fucking Jade Dragon. Done. That's mine now. I'll be taking that off your hands. I remind you all, this is the artifact acquisition mod. This is not added by the, uh, the, the After the End Old World mod. This is a completely separate thing. But works perfectly with it. And I, it, again, it's a mod that I would highly recommend. So, we're going to go on a heist to, to steal the Jade Dragon. Or in this case, the Golden Eagle of the Nigerian Empire. Okay, convince some servants to let me in. Force my way inside. 82% chance. So, it's based on your stats as well. Just for those two of you who don't know how this works. So, because we've got higher martial. Because we took our martial with us. The martial option is obviously the most likely one to succeed. We've already failed. Uh, I, hate this, I hate this character. I hate her. I hate her. She just wants to... I, I will strangle you to death myself. And to be honest, I think I could probably fucking pull it off, even though I am one foot in the grave right now. I mean, to be honest, you're... <laughs> I was going to say one foot in the grave, but I guess that would be... I mean, that's true all the time. Sorry. Um, find my way out. Because the worst case scenario in that one is you... I'm going to lose a lot of prestige, but worst case in that one is you become wounded. So we're already wounded. No no harm. Double wounded. Oh, the Pope's built his money stop power back up. Thank you very much. We didn't actually make too much from that Merchant Republic. We'll have to check out the one in Crimea next time. Um... Only 400 gold. <laughs> Only 400. Uh, this time around, I know that we are stacking up a load of debts, but obviously they more than pay for itself with the amount of loot that we can get from this. Oh, hello. Appreciate religion in Fam Augusta. Time has come for us to embrace Jesus. Nah, you're okay. That seems very counterproductive to what we're trying to aim for here. He actually got it? We can use all this gold that we're picking up just to hire a shitload of mercenaries. Oh, they fucked up the quest then. You morons. Why did you not let me join you? I'm so annoyed. Okay, how are we looking? 552. Last luxury journey. They failed. So that is now the end of it. Now we can't fire that again for another 200 years, right? Not been done for 100 years. I'm so... I'm angry at myself. I, sh I fired it too early. But I think it was worth firing it early because there was a chance we could have pulled it off with our other character as well. Let's get this gold back. So I don't like being this much in debt for this long. And now we're the leader. Now that they failed the journey, I'm the leader. <laughs> I hate you people. I hate you so much. If the if the journey fails, you should be able to do it in a smaller time frame. 
in my opinion. I feel like if it's a failure, it should be 50 years. Even 50 years is quite long. But 100 years is bloody nuts, given that I've had campaigns that have lasted less time than that. Entire campaigns. To span those rightly troops. They're shit anyway. They were inherited troops. Right, okay. So we could go raiding. Um, yes, thank you. We could go raiding. If We could min-max it actually massively. Raid along this coast. Raise and lower our boats from this coast. So get the treasure... Dash them back, drop them, just about there to see another one, raid it. That sounds like absolutely insane min-maxing, which I might do. And then it's just all out, because I think that sounds boring as fuck to leave in. Um, oh, wait, Jerusalem split away? We've got Jerusalem and Israel as two separate states. Permanently? That's not even like a rebellion or anything. Gavel kind? Fucked them? Israel is agnatic cognatic primogeniture. Jerusalem is agnatic cognatic primogeniture. Inherited from this guy who died. Rui the page of our law. What the fuck? This isn't how that's supposed to go. You can't do that. Shoot him or something. What the hell has happened? I have no idea. Um, yeah, I mean, we, we can just siege these guys instead then. Because they've got a lot of bloody gold. I will admit, I went very tunnel vision there trying to get that... Uh, trying to get that Legendary Gathering to work. So we want to start passing new laws again. Uh, if I got anyone I can sack... Okay, I'll start inviting people to court with high opinion. Um, just so that we can fire some of our councillors, replace them with other councillors, etc, etc. Trying to get some loyalists on board. Um, we've got enough money to buy a couple of favours. Enough that we would need to pass a law. Bear in mind, it's 80 gold for an unlanded, uh, non-greedy randomer. So, look at that. We've already got ourselves one. Okay. Swap him out for him. It's not much of a downgrade either. Um, keep him on board because he is the Jewish courtier. So, will give us all of those tasty tech points. Husband, why do you not like us? You're being a bit of a dick. Uh, let's see if we can bribe this guy. Buy favour. 80 gold. Nice. By favor. You? Do you want some, you want some of that gold? Done. Uh, she's obviously our sister, so we'll want a lot more cash. 400? 400, yeah. Uh, husband. By favor. 80 gold. No? What if we send him a gift first? By favor. Still no. Oh, you're a dick. Um, so we've got those two in the bag. We need just one last vote. By favor from you. 75. Done. Hey, thank you. Okay. And then let's go ahead and call in our council support here. No? Call in council support. What? Oh, not already influenced by a favor. Who's doing it? You're sacked. You're gone. Who's doing it? Despot Aurelius the Strong. Despot Aurelius the Strong. Aurelius, my husband, is fucking us over like this. Be gone. I was going to sack him anyway because he's our husband. So we're losing a load of state diplomacy keeping on the council too. Fuck it. If you're going to be an ass, you're fired, brother. Oh, husband. I shouldn't say that about a husband. It makes for some very confusing legal situations. Right, send this guy a gift. Just in case maybe he's up for it as well. Right, we good? Can I can I now influence my brother? Okay, here we are. Calling count support, boom. And now you calling count support, boom. It's three votes. What the hell was I thinking? Oh, because one's a loyalist, I remember. Um Yeah. Three supporters an hour vote. Means four. Abolished council. Go. Come on, don't let me down. Oh, there we are. Okay, cool. Use the trait Gemini. Is Gemini good? I mean all of the Honestly, all of the star sign traits are shit. I might rebalance those. We need a mod for it. Um, all right, martial education for you. How's Ireland coming through? Haughty is the worst childhood trait. Proud, arbitrary, or cruel. Great. I mean, cruel's not terrible. And arbitrary is okay in the right scenario. Um, okay, fantastic. So all we need now is to get centralization, which is very, very easy to pass because a lot of the people, aren't, none of the people on the council give a fuck about it. Excellent. So the hard part's done. Now we just got to survive long enough to flip this over into the centralized kingdom. You could also pass that one for the fun of it. Hey, thank you. Uh, the council don't get to vote on it anymore, do they? Council change law, uh, 43. So we've got 10 years on that one. Fucking hell. 10 years on that one too. That was not from this, by the way. That was from obviously changing the count's power. Horrors to suffer in this life. Let's see who I appoint the Magistros of the realm. <sighs> God. Um... <laughs> Fine. Perform statecraft. Husband got fired in favor of a bloody horse. Only the finest armor can protect Glitterhoof. You're welcome. Golden stallion armor for Glitterhoof, noble steed. Friend is here does not stand to inherit any land of his own. But fucking hell, we got seven out of... Four out of seven on domain size. Um, we get charitable. We give this guy some land. Hopefully he'll die before any has any kids. Then we take it back. Good idea. Um... I can actually be persuaded to do that, because that's free charitable. It'll make our vassals' likes a bit more. Not that we have to worry about that particularly right now. Um, sure. You know what? I'm up for that. No, I'm not, actually. No, fuck you. Four out of seven. I want more land. Get out of here. Um, so, really, we want to look for righteous revocation on our vassals as well. And if we've got the... If we've got all this extra domain size all of a sudden. And Greece is being reduced to a pile of rubble. Let's also pursue that one too, then. So, we've got the county. And then we've also got the... 
duchy. Is there any more... Uh, are there any more holy sites in Greece proper? Doesn't look like it. We got Alexandria, which is obviously under Israel, which will hand my ass to me. Uh, Lentini, which is what the Jowers shout when they're afraid. That one's doable. I think Libya is doable. Um... <laughs> I might fire Glitter Hoof, though, because I have a feeling his chance to fabricate claims is quite small. 16% uh, chance of infuriating in the noble because we sent a horse to his court. Okay, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to hire a new diplomat. Bear with me here. How are we looking now? 6.4%. It's still not good. Um, were we after Syracusa? Was that it? Lentini? Yeah, it is. Okay, good. I'll send him a gift as well. Try and cheer him up. Or not. I'll give him a... Nope. Okay, I won't do anything. Never mind. How have we run out of gold again? What have I spent all this bloody money on? Nothing. Expenses are zero. Uh, please help. My family is starving. <gasps> a child. Uh, Glitter Hoof died then, huh? We've immediately received the... Yep. Died horsing around immediately, age 17. Brilliant. Now we have the golden styling armor for ourselves. Now, the cool thing about that is we can just give it out as a gift, and it's worth a shitload of opinion, because it's qu it's a quality three gift, after all. Um, I don't like you. We can't declare war on you? Why? Oh, uh, no, I was going to say we're bankrupt. Why can't we declare war on you? The button isn't even there. Is he out of Diplo range? What? Give up. No, 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 he's not. He's not. He's not. Because we can interact. What? There's not even a uh, declare war option. Oh, we're already at war with him. Oh, right. Because I joined my... Sorry, I have played this game once or twice before. Euphemios. Astute. Show me. Fuck. Oh, God. No. Don't even bother trying to save him. No, no, no. Only the strong survive. Seriously. This kid's good for one thing. And that's like... That's fish food right now. Goodbye. Fussy and haughty. I feel like Marshall is not her way forward. Oh, she also got Taurus. Oh, that's annoying. Um, yeah, we'll help you. Uh, Emiricos, the wife, Peter. Uh, all right, yeah. Yeah, we'll, we'll give you a hand there, Chief. By which I mean... What, what is this? Oh, my God. Of all the events to get. One of the rarer events in CK2. I will admit, ever since you lost your limbs, you've started seeing things in a new light. Animals seem to consider you less frightening. They often approach you more than other, uh, more often than your courtiers. Whether or not it's pity or affection, you will never know. This one particular bird seems to have your intention most loyal friend. A parrot that hates everyone, but likes sitting on your shoulders. Because, Rock, best friend, we gain loyal parrot, giving plus two marshal, because we're missing, we've got one eye, an eye patch, we've got a hook for a hand, and a peg leg. We're a fucking pirate. We go out raiding from our island, we're a pirate. So we've been giving ourselves a parrot. That's base game CK2 as well, by the way. Okay, that's not bad. One son has brilliant strategies. Not fantastic. He's got look, he's got organizer too, which is great. Um Build a war chest. Yikes. 700 gold. I mean we could do it with a with a Rome raid, but Paragon of Virtue, 2,000 pies. That's a bit difficult. Yeah, strength of the Hellenic religion. I think that one's sensible. So we have to win three holy wars, uh, successfully defend against holy war, construct a temple, convert a bronze to Hellenic, complete a special opportunity, create the same task multiple times, task complete is zero, of course. Right, okay, um, construct a temple, seems like one we could probably start work on right now. Uh, it's kind of a waste of a holding slot, although here we can't build anything else but a temple. So, wait, oh, we can build a tribal holdings. Um, five, five, three. Or, alternatively, we save up the money to, I, I, honestly, I think it might be better to actually build the temple, strangely enough, and hear me out. If we, the only way we can possibly take the holy sites is by buying mercenaries. And we're not going to have that opportunity too frequently. If they declare war on us again, and we don't have the money to raise the mercenaries, we lose it, that's it, it's gone. Unless we push it in the same lifetime, which I think it's unlikely we're going to be able to do, and we'd have to fabricate claims. So I think it'd be better to get all the claims into position, get the get the morale into position the religious moral authority i should say into position then push the claims simultaneously with one with hire all the mercenaries once push all the claims war after war after war take all three with a big enough mercenary band to be able to rock them then reform the religion instantly then after that if they count as like we can get rid of the mercenaries obviously we don't have to worry about affording them that stage if yugoslavia come in with their big dick and slap us around we haven't got to worry about it because we've already reformed the religion that's we're already getting the bonuses um I wonder if we could conquest the rest of Greece. Maybe just grab it for ourselves. Would it be better to fight Greece or fight Yugoslavia? Let's be honest. Um, I think I'd rather take Greece right now. Because they've only got 6,000 men. We've got 5,400 and better commanders. And they're at war with someone else. I think we'll come and grab this one. Sure, Yugoslavia might declare war on us. But this we can fight with our own levies. So I think this one's a safer bet for the time being. 
Right, get a... Oh, God. Look at this. Absolute mess. Yeah, to, to war. 20% morale of armies as well. They're probably not going to do that. I don't even know if the AI is affected by by the war sacrifice, are they? I'm not entirely sure. Um, let's go pick our actual armies up now. Genius. This is just the worst commanding I've ever seen in my whole life. Right, okay. Uh, Ireland on set. Look, 34, 26, and 21. Even if these guys field a 1,000 troops, we can probably wipe them out. Speaking of which... Hello. <laughs> Free war skill. Okay. Um... Oh, shit. So they've already got Athens seized, which is a bit of a pain in the ass, I will admit. Shouldn't have assaulted that. I don't know why. I was kind of hoping we can knock down Athens, but apparently not. 28%. All right, let's just grab it as soon as possible. Let's just try and cut the other guys off. So we do need to move fast to be able to stop the other guys getting war score. Um, yeah, whatever. I'm trying to swear my husband as well, because he's also a diplomat to make it again, because he's got the 20... Um, he's got 20 diplomacy, which makes him the best diplomat by far. Okay, I'm hoping they'll cancel the top level of their capital. Slap that child. Don't mess with Ireland. That's it. You, how brave of you to beat up a child. 50%. Okay. This is going to be very, very close, isn't it? Thebes. Be gone. Shit. Uh, the debt's racking up. I can't help but notice that. Fucking hell. These boats are so expensive. You know what? Be gone. Either we... Here's my plan. Either we win and we take it for ourselves, or you don't come home. You either die, or you take it and we can disband there. There's no middle ground here. All right, let's go for the actual war goal. Surrender comes sooner. Thank you very much for letting me know. I don't know why you did that. 62%. Shit, this is going to be expensive. They've dropped 5,000 troops in my capital. Oh, bollocks. Um, well, let's hope they send them back because... Charitable. Okay, that's fine. Oh, God. Oh, God. Jeff, fucking call in your allies, you moron. I completely forgot that we had the ally system. Hang on. We can probably clap so many cheeks. I didn't even think about that. We could we could probably take all these claims. Join me, join me, join me, join me. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, connect. Just zero troops. Incredible. Absolutely fantastic dedication to the war. That's what we're after right there. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Look at this. Oh, it's 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 a sure it's a surefire thing. So oh, we got 10% morale on top of the other 20% morale is quite nice. Uh, so they can siege our shit down. Makes no difference at this stage. They would have to come and counter siege their stuff. Yeah, we've won. Boom. That, my friends, is a holy sight. Very nice. So now what? Um, well, obviously, we wait for our money to recharge. You know, I completely, genuinely, completely forgot that we could call in. We've got Syracuse, and we've also got... Okay, so we've got two more holy sites on the menu. Zero moral authority, because these guys have been absolutely destroyed by Yugoslavia. We might have to try and dismantle Yugoslavia. Sorry, Tito, your time has come. What's he got here? St. George? Let's kill him. Let's kill him in the hopes that it'll just decentralize the realm. It's always good to get a bit of succession crisis going on. Look, all his vassals fucking want him gone. We've got no money either. So the fact that they're willing to go for it. Oh, another dragon amulet? Come on. No, no, no. I'm not scared of the emperor. Come on. Give me that dragon amulet. Give me, give me, fuck off. Allow the jewel. Fuck. God damn it. That would have been quite nice to grab. Let's leave it for, here for today because tomorrow... I genuinely think we might be able to reform the religion with some sensible wars. So that is now our official goal. And don't forget tomorrow, we can... I think all the all of the pieces are going to start falling into place. We can, we can take the confederacy, turn it into feudal kingdom, and we can reform the religion. Then we sail. We sail across the world, unify the islands. We take ourselves one Atlantis, please, brother. Sorry, Atlantis machine broken. Understandable. Have a nice day. And you know who has the nicest day of all? That's right. It's the patrons. Thank you to Northern Bear, Atmosis, Fakuna Vasquez, Tyler McClam, Caden Carter, Huey Longdon, Gogolus, Bellex Strombo, Chesty, The One Ring, Derek, Paul, Chris, and Crow Skull for their support. The insane tier levels on Patreon. The highest of the high, the best of the best. Thank you, my friends, for your support. And a thank you as well goes out to equally as appreciated but not on such a high list because of uh, denumeration. Thank you to Joseph Fear, Sir Thor the Swede, Rob Girth, Sweet Sea, Nick, Meow Volcano, Better Valerian, Silent Sentinel, Corgi Circus, Mythomatic, Coded Coke, Tempe, Night Rouge, Kevin Sanders, Distorted Triangle, and everyone else at Patreon as well. Thank you all for your support. Big appreciation. See you guys all tomorrow for some additional Crusader Kings? Anybody up for some Crusader Kings? Assuming I'm not dead.